Hey guys, what's up? So today I am going to give you the solution of pangrams from the hacker rank in the JavaScript format. So let's move on to the topic. So first I will open hacker rank and uh, then I will log in. Then I will open my problem solving kit and let's search it and here it is so it uh, i think that you have uh, read the problem so let's move to the solution so solution is a uh, very simple uh, I only have to judge on three main points first let's see the uh, sample input so it is a pangram pangram means that it contains all alphabets so to check if it is a pangram let's say firstly we have to remove these spaces so we can remove these spaces by adding a regular expression so let's move on so here is our function function pangrams okay so so let's define a string which contains all the alphabets let's name it compare string okay comparing string comparing string equals to a b c d e f g h i j k l m n o p q r s t u v w x y z okay so now we have to remove the spaces from the string so we can do it by using regular expressions or you can do it by any uh, preferred method so i will declare a variable variable s1 is equals to so when we want to replace something we use s dot replace and we will add this is used for regular expression and under this regular expression term is written so i will write uh, slash or backwards left s this means that i want to remove s and it should be implemented globally and it should be replaced with a string empty string so now whenever it comes so s1 has a string which has no spaces so and now we have to if we see here there some letters are capitalized as well as uh, many are uh, some are in lower case so first uh, then we convert all the letters to lower case letters so we convert s1 equals to s1 dot to lower case okay so now all the characters have in this string have no spaces between them and they are uh, converted to lower case so our next step is to split them into a string so let's split them into a string with another variable variable s2 equals to s1 dot i think uh, you might know the split method I, as it is commonly used in uh, javascript as well as other programming languages so now our string is converted into an array a singular array which can uh, in which each uh, character e ha in which each array element is composed of a single character okay 
so now there may be some duplicate elements as well if you see here so here a has occurred uh, two times okay here e has occurred two times or three times so we have to remove duplicate elements and there is a very good method to remove duplicate elements please remember that so i will do that variable s3 equals to please remember it's a very good method to remove duplicates new and i will say set and i want to remove duplicates from s2 okay and please remember that the duplication removal is applicable only on the array okay that's why we have converted s2 into an array okay sorry s1 into an array and we have applied the um, the average duplicate removal on s2 okay so now our work is very easy now we will uh, sort it with new variable variable s4 equals to s3 dot sort okay so now our element is sorted and each element each in array each element is a unique element and it is alphabetically sorted so now let's convert it into a uh, our original string with a new variable equals to s4 dot join it converts an array into an string okay and here we are done here so now a little bit of if conditional statements if now if s5 equals to equals to comparing string sorry i have written comparing a uh, little incorrect it will be comparing okay comparing string if s5 equals to equals to comparing string then return pangram okay and otherwise i don't need to have if uh, else statement i just will return uh, pan, not pangram not pangram okay so let's check our uh, test codes oh wow it's a uh, it run run successfully so let's submit our code all right our test gets submitted successfully so for the solution you can take screenshot here i will keep still here i can uh, increase the screen size for your clarity okay that's clear okay please let me know in the comment section how was the video and how was the solution please let me know